holiday solar stakes are the deal of the week. We got Santa and a snowman. And look down here. These uh, glitter Christmas trees, they are going to light up. Only a few. Oh, wow. I wish I was here on the weekend. Oh, actually, it looks like they may have more down there. So here is the wall of ornaments. And I'm pretty sure you've seen a lot of this stuff already on um, everybody who does Dollar Tree hauls and Dollar Tree videos. Look, we got a Santa. <laughs> He's in a sleigh. I don't remember this one from last year. It kind of looks, if you really look at it, like sugar. You know, um, we just got done watching, you know, um, Cake Wars and like Gingerbread House for Halloween. Yeah. And they do a lot of stuff with like the sugar. But it kind of reminds me of it. I don't know why. And look, they got a snowman one. And now it's going to be Holiday Wars. Oh my gosh. I love the baking, the holiday baking. Those are my favorite to watch. You're going to get two here. A little snowflake and a stocking. Little snowman guy. <laughs> And Santa. Oh, this one's a little different. Oh, it kind of like, kind of looks like a little braids from far away. <laughs> oh, look, they have this here. You get five. Now, in Hobby Lobby, they do have something like this, but it's going to cost you more. So you get five for a dollar. They have silver, and I see a red one. Here is, you know, like the church. I've seen a lot of people haul this for your door, for your classroom. You can hear everybody going in and out using the bathroom <laughs> look at the candy cane joy um this would be cute um like a little tag like an extra add-on for a gift put that on top we got the glitter reindeer <laughs> snowman with a bell i don't think i've seen that one these are really cute down here too you can get two they have a silver one the red truck Oh, they got the bell. I kind of like these bells. They got a red, glitter, and silver, and they do have a gold one. They also have a plain white one. I'm not really into the glitter stuff. I kind of like, um, I saw this rustic looking bell at Joanne's. I kind of like that one. Oh, the rusted one? Yeah. yeah that cool. Look at the clips here. Okay, those you know, are cute. They're painted red, they look good too. Yeah. Just like plain red. Yeah. Santa hat and bells again. Oh, this is uh, more ornaments. Okay, we got a reindeer one. Silver and gold. They do have the dove. Little elf shoes or stockings. <laughs> oh, look at that snowflake. Um, that looks like something I've seen at the at-home store. Here, you get it for a dollar. At-home store, you guys, they're pretty pricey on their Christmas ornaments. I'm not going to lie. I want to say, <sighs> check out Joanne's. If you want something like that, they do have some glam stuff. Oh, yeah, nice. And um, yeah. possibly JCPenney will probably be cheaper than the at oh at home store. Oh, you know who's cheap, guys? Tuesday morning. I know a lot of people will probably think they are very pricey. Actually, their Christmas ornaments are, to me, inexpensive. I mean, really, really nice glass blown ones. Um, they very, very nice they for have like some of those sixty dollars. Six dollars. Like, yeah. For like ten, yeah, like ten dollars. Because some of that stuff you could find in Dillard's in Tuesday morning. And Dillard's wants like $60. So don't forget to check out Tuesday morning. Um, they have really nice um, Christmas ornaments. Look at that angel. I did do a video on that. So, you know, <laughs> if any, anybody wants to watch that one. Hope. Um, okay. We got the tree topper. And then the pickle. Okay, I was trying to look up the deal with the pickle. So I was reading about the Christmas pickle and there are so many stories behind it and one of them was a um, store that sold a lot of fruit um, ornaments had a lot of like um, was it cucumbers or something it you said extra pickles extra yeah. pickles yeah, they, they, and they couldn't sell them so they made up like a little story to yeah, sell the, it the, the poem or whatever on here is actually made up by the, the store uh, clerk yeah so, so those yeah them. so i don't know that was a story i came up with when i was searching for it um so i was like what is the deal but look we do have the cone trees with the tinsel going on they do got the bells they got the red and gold here ribbon we got red and gold 
this one, you know, says like, you know, joyful, Merry Christmas, satin ribbon. We got candy cane and like little presents in there. You can never go wrong with these uh, buckets. We use them for cookies, to store cookies and, you know, extra, um, anything that we make for the holidays, we store them in there and we pass them around. So here's some stuff for like your classroom, a Sunday school, homeschool, whatever it is that you do. Um, I do um, stuff like this for Sunday school. So stickers here, we got paddle balls, we have erasers. Also you guys, don't forget Operation Christmas Child is going on. So some of this stuff you could put in their shoe box. There is a little train set. <laughs> These never work for me, I have no idea why. Um, we have the bracelet to bells. They got the necklace going on. The light up one. This is my alley right here. Right up my alley. Um, Disneyland has one like this. I never bought it there. But I always forget to buy it when I'm there. But I might buy that one here. It's only a dollar. I like to wear lights. <laughs> and then we got the plushies here. Here you get a two pack. Another great gift for the office when you're having a potluck or something, you know, you put like extra cookies in there or chocolate or something. They got a red penguin one and I see a rubber ducks down there like Santa and Elf. Those are funny. Candy cane Rudolph. I always see this one each year. Oh, I haven't seen this one. <laughs> the like truck. By Palmer though, but you have to really like Palmer chocolate. I personally don't like it, but you know, sometimes you know kids they don't know. <laughs> uh, peanut clusters here. They just think it's old candy. They got the trolls and Paw Patrol, caramel Santa Claus, and the marshmallow ones. You know, I never was a fan of marshmallow, even as a kid. But they also have the chocolate snowman. Those are going to be seventy nine cent. The candy stick. And we do have rock candy too. It looks like you get two for a dollar. My husband loves rock candy. <laughs> like even if we're in like on vacation or something or out of town, he has to have rock candy, I noticed. <laughs> and um we have cotton candy here. Lots to choose from. Russell Stover chocolate, little mini boxes. And of course they have the peppermint bark. It looks like a crisp in there too. Um, what else do they have? Popping candy. I usually put this stuff in my kids' stockings. Oh look at that little guy. He's cute. Hershey Snowman. <laughs> I have never seen that no, one. I like those. those are neat. You know what? I used to love love these, but now that I'm getting older, I don't know if I really like it anymore. I feel like my taste is changing. But look, <laughs> red, red hot hots. candy canes. Okay. I like those would be good really um they have cold stone and now and later i love now and later especially the apple um what is starburst has good candy kings oh what's the flavors of the cold stone okay we got mint chocolate chip strawberry blonde and birthday cake all right <laughs> more chocolate cups you know like peanut butter cups um more cold stone down there oh my gosh i swear at work and even when you go to the doctor office or something, there's always a jar of this stuff. <laughs> Especially my Nana. <laughs> uh, I used to like this stuff actually when I was little because I used to go to my mom's work all the time with her on the weekend um, when she would just pop in on the weekend. And um, I used to like it, but now, uh. <laughs> here we got uh, more chocolate. Yeah, that's so funny. Oh, and they do have the Smarty candy cane. Need some coal for your children. I remember one year when my kids were younger. I mean, they're still young, you know. My my youngest is 10. But I used to, like with my son when he was younger, I used to buy coal. And then I would put it like around, like leading up to the Christmas tree, you know. <laughs> um, I don't know. We used to do stuff like that. Uh, more Rudolph candy. That is going to be gummies. We got chocolate coins here. A gumball machine. Oh, look, they have the nerds here. Warhead and Sweet Tart. Okay, good, good, good stuff. Frosty the Snowman. You're gonna get 24 and Rudolph. I know sometimes this stuff is kind of hard to take for a classroom because everyone has like an allergy now. You know what I mean? People are allergic, and 
it kind of like does suck the fun out of things because teachers now are becoming really strict. No, he's allergic <laughs> to water. So, um, cookies and cream down here. Caramel Russell Stover and these are good. I love this stuff right here. <laughs> you know, Olive Garden has this, okay? It's so funny because Olive Garden puts it in their own wrapper. And I'm like, it's the same thing. <laughs> I used to like staying at the Biltmore because they would put those on your pillows after they clean the room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my husband grew up fancy living. <laughs> um, and then look at this little gingerbread house candy. Okay, that's funny and cute. We have some crafts, Christmas crafts ornaments. You can get two, the fake snow. We got the tiny little ones, which are really good for slime. But you know what? They do fall out, okay? They fall out. And so does the bigger one. But it's a good um, sensory project, you know, you guys. We got Make Your Own Gingerbread Man made out of felt. You only get, I think, one. Oh, what should we get? Like three or something. And we have lots of bells over here. We got the bows with the bell, little mini bows. I like uh, red bows on trees. And of course, if you need ornament hooks, you guys, don't forget at the Dollar Tree, okay? Because I noticed sometimes. We, I don't know how they get loose in like your bin or something, and then you're looking for them. You, you always need backup, right? I almost feel like <laughs> just putting them on and twisting them with the pliers and then hot gluing them. Maybe. Right. <laughs> Look at this one. Little sticker decal. Um, snowflake. You got blue up here. They got the tinsel stems. They got the mesh tube going on. Oh, look at this one. A diamond wrap. They got the glitter. And more ribbon. Okay, this is like a wreath. Um, you know, I have a Christmas tree. Okay, yeah. I bought this Christmas tree for my daughter for her dolls. And you know how they're very flimsy. And you know, flimsy. Like I wonder. Brush. Yeah, and it's missing. You know, it has a lot of gaps in it. I need to find that extra garland. I can't find it here because, you know, you just hook it onto the tree. I can't just go and buy her a nice one. Um, but they're for her dolls. I don't want to spend, like, anything $10 for yeah, a doll. A nice thing for my doll. <laughs> and, um, so do you have the white hair? I do have the mini lights. Um, these are white. Look at the garland clip. Okay, I might get that for her. And look, they got a tree skirt. I was showing her all this cool stuff, you know. Because uh, she uses it for her dolls. No need to spend so much money for one time yeah, use. Yeah, they're going to have a storage I mean? room with the ornaments. And over here, like this stuff reminds me of being in school. You know, we got the Christmas tree, snowman, oh, yeah, Santa sleigh. Teacher yeah, teacher decorations. We and like you know what? Party City does have stuff like this. But do not buy this stuff at Party City or Big Lots, okay? Big Lots, believe it or not, Big Lots has uh, decor like this. Do not buy it there. Come to the Dollar Tree if you're going to use it for your classroom or something, okay? And we're going to have the tinsel garland. All types to choose from. Have a holly jolly Christmas. Oh, look at that one up there. That one's different. And then you have the, you know, like plaid bow. I did find some Christmas cards. Believe in the magic of Christmas. Um, wishing you all the magic that this holiday season brings a snowman one how many do you get you get 14 same one with a santa here's a gingerbread one let's see i do i want to do something i want to send out um christmas cards to you guys but i have to figure out a way how to do it so that I would only be able to send out like maybe a hundred because you know it gets gonna it's gonna get costly I don't know how to think about that, but I would love to do that. Um, let's see. Miniatures. Look at their faces. Wow. <laughs> that is like... Looks like a kindergartner did that, really. <laughs> so they're in the it is like store. really, really... Even for a dollar, that's like they didn't care. You know Michael's is starting to look like that, too. Oh, the Michael Lee Max? And they're orange. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We got gift tags <laughs> here. And we got the coloring painting set. Boxes. You can never go wrong with a gift box. You're only going to get two though. Let me see. That's just Santa. Ho, ho, ho. Um, what is this one? Hmm. <laughs> Another Santa one. I think they're all going to be a repeat. Yep. 
and that one's different in the back. Of course, bows here. I see some signs down here. And Merry Christmas. That one's kind of cute. Like a house in an ornament shape. There's no place like home. <laughs> and we have a Santa. Happy holidays. A snowman. Oh, this one's really cute. You could find something like this in Joanne. Yeah, this is only a dollar, you guys. That one's cute. A lot of the snowmen here. Same stuff. And this over here. There's some candy in there. Homemade fudge or something. I did find some more gift box. You're going to get four snowmen. Oh, it looks like the same stuff. Best gift ever was this one. Happy holidays. Oh, come on. Mm. Oh, look at this one. I like snowman. I mean, a snowman penguin. <laughs> that one's kind of cute. Let's see what's in here. This one, you're going to get three. There's a snowman one with like a stamp. I wonder if they're all those. Oh, I think all those are gonna be the same there. Gotta put this one back. Um, what else do they have? Okay, here's a little shoe box, you know, for Operation Christmas Child. But I feel like these shoe boxes are kind of short and tiny. I normally buy the ones like from Target or Walmart. These are always fun to put in stockings. My kids love stuff like that. Another stocking stuffer, like Play-Doh um, shapes, you know, cutouts. Only a dollar, not bad. Here's a cute little frog bubbler maker, and they do have a hippo one. Have you guys bought the bubble makers here from the Dollar Tree? Let me know if they do work, because not bad. Like I said before, my daughter buys stuff like that for her dolls. <laughs> Bath bombs, okay, a dollar. You can find the same stuff right now at Walmart, you guys. It will be the same price, but um, they do have it here in the Dollar Tree. Uh, Crayola sidewalk chalk you can normally find this in target dollar spot but you get a lot of green and yellow you don't get a lot of variety <laughs> and then they do have the big jumbo ones up here i probably would go with something like this one and the miracle bubbles are here in the dollar tree now i have tried miracle bubbles and personally i don't like them because they don't really work i mean i know they're a dollar but i do like a what's it called gazillion bubbles that that's a good brand um yeah but they also have them sometimes um for like you know a dollar or two dollars in walmart you just have to look we got emoji stuff going on you know the felt in markers they used to have a whole bunch when i was a kid lisa frank the unicorn all that stuff i had all that <laughs> transformers we have um oh these uh you know are these sticker ones yeah as a kid, I don't know what it was called then. They were like pillow stickers that you can even put on your window and you make a scene. I had those as a kid. More Disney. We got a dry erase board. SpongeBob. Don't say it. <laughs> Snakes and ladders. You know, like shoots and ladders. That one's funny, actually. Checkers up there. I love checkers. One of eels and escalators. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hangman, <laughs> pretty much. That's so funny. Remember playing Hangman? <laughs> and then, of course, puzzles here. And we do have, like, trading cards or stickers. Star Wars, My Little Pony. They used to have an electronic Hangman game. They got, like, football here. WrestleMania, I see. Was that Frida Kahlo? <laughs> like a puzzle. Uh, Peppa Pig puzzle, but you're... Kids, if you guys are going to give a puzzle, make sure they like puzzles, okay? Don't just give it to give it because, you know, my mom is the type of mom, and I get on her about it. I'm joking with her, and she knows it. She loves to give educational gifts. She's that type of person. <laughs> And I'm like, Mom, they don't care. And, like, They're even if it's not for my kids and she was gifting something, I'm like, Mom, come yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> you know how long the freaking return line of Target is? <laughs> <laughs> so make sure they absolutely love puzzles and love to do them because, you know, yeah. My mom's funny, but, you know, she's a educational gift type of grandma. 
<laughs> All right, let's just keep moving. Um, okay. Wow, everything is a mess here. I wonder a bunch of little kids went through here. This is like the teacher area. Draw and write. Okay, yeah. See you life. Oh, wow, I can't believe how messy it is. All right, um, anything new going on in the book section? You know, they had something kind of interesting. The new order? Which one? It was a story, and instead of about Robin Hood, it's about Will Scarlet growing up. And then, uh... How he helps Robin Hood become Robin Hood. Oh, really? Yeah. Movie star, a novel. Okay. Um, what else is there? Let me see. Freedom. Um, little. Nope. I don't really see that much going on here. I've seen yeah. that one last time. Looks like the Star Wars ones are sold out. Oh, yeah. They still got that one. That one's still <laughs> here. <laughs> you know what? I am so behind on watching the show. I'm sure it's over by now, but on demand, I think they took some off already. They already took them yeah. So, <laughs> I'm behind on that show. Like, I only watched, like, the first three. And then, you know, life catches up with you and just couldn't watch it. <laughs> Um, same one, yeah. I see a lot of the same stuff here from last time. I did find TGI Friday's Creamy Parmesan Mashed Potatoes with Panko. And they do have mac and cheese here too. And of course, Hamburger Helper. <laughs> the Stroganoff Jambalaya Mix. My oldest is such a rice eater. Like, he loves rice. And that's why I was asking about the cauliflower rice in Costco. Because i got to replace that. <laughs> He's my... Um, how do I want to say it? He's my, like, kid who loves to eat, like... Savory stuff. Yeah, like, fancy stuff, you know? And I don't know where he got that from. But he's like, oh, can I have some salmon, salmon with, with lemon, lemon mm. and uh, <laughs> like all this extra, extra. I'm like, oh gosh. <laughs> Everybody else eating steak and burgers, he wants salmon. Green. And pumpkin pie mix, but he likes squid and like all that stuff that I don't. So I have to like learn how to like make that stuff. That's how Frazier's do. <laughs> <laughs> and he is a like gumbo kid. See, that's what's so weird. And I, actually, I'm going to make him gumbo uh, this week, so I need to, like, look up a recipe. And it looks pretty easy. I think I could probably eat that. I'm just going to make a gumbo with no seafood because I can't eat seafood. Okay, what else do they have going on here? Chocolate. Okay, that's always here, I see. It looks like they're going to restock the Dollar Tree soon. Well, my Dollar Tree because a lot of their shelves are bare even in the refrigerator section. It is, like... It is like really, really empty. These are actually really nice for cold root beer or, you know, if you drink beer or something, that would be a nice one. We had the glass bowl with lid, microwave safe. Look at this one too. With the lid, a little sugar on the side, keep it on the table. They never have stuff like that. We got mason jar, more like a medium small container. Okay. Oh, that is all new here. And the bowls are still here. Like the clear um, glass bowls. You know, they're only a dollar. Not bad. Big Lots has these for almost like $2. Did find Airhead bath bombs. <laughs> oh, look at that. That is new. Okay. New stuff going on. Lots of loofahs in here. Lots of stuff to make a gift basket. Like a spa gift basket. We got the hair wrap. You got the petty tool there. You know, the one that looks like a foot filer that reminds me of a cheese grater. It reminds me of a cheese grater, okay? Cheese grater the commercial it. always shows that, you know, dumping it out. And I think of cheese. I know that might sound gross. It's like, oh, <laughs> oh, it does. It reminds me of that. I'm like, oh, no. Mm. What is this one? Oh, like a car, a uh, little loofah. Mm. Toothbrush holders. That's not soap on a rope, huh? <laughs> what do we have? More bath bombs here. Looks like they got plenty here. The unicorn and the mermaid and the butterfly is still here. That is another great stocking stuffer. So I finally found the yes to here in my Dollar Tree. I have been seeing people haul them like crazy. And yeah, I would buy it here. If you see it at the Dollar Tree, you guys, buy it here. Because it's like, you know, 
almost four something dollars in Target, maybe between four or five dollars Target Ulta. Um, and you know what? I do have one of these. I bought one at Ulta like a while ago and I did not care for it, but not for that price. So I would, you know, pick it up here in the Dollar Tree. Um, I noticed they're all um, powder to clay mask and they do have a sleeping mask and the tomato and I think that is it and the cucumber and of course you know they got the bath salt here um what is this one like a mist and lotion I see um, acrylic stuff going on like little mini acrylic stuff to keep in your bathroom like the drawer set right here q-tips and whatnot just a little bit here going on in my Dollar Tree my makeup section doesn't have that much here we got BB cream you know um, elf fan brush a lip gloss more elf wet and wild we got the glitter going on eyelashes a little bit of lip balm I got skittles a lot of skittles let's see nail pedicure set Hmm, normally they have a lot of lip balm. Usually, hopefully when Christmas comes around sooner, they start bringing out the lip smacker. They always sell like single lip smacker here. <laughs> Lisa Frank press on nails. Wet and Wild nail polish. A couple of that. Um, and that is going to do it for the makeup section. <laughs> and then of course it is um, all nail polish over here. All right, I found some lip balm on my way out. We got Pez, Lucky Charms, Mike and Ike, um, Trix, and more Mike and Ike, uh, Ninja Turtles, Skittles, Jolly Rancher, and a Fanta. I've Don't never you seen wanna? Fanta. Wanna Fanta? Oh, there's Coke <laughs> back there too. Oh, they got Coke one too. Let me see. So they got the Fanta here. Can you reach that? Yeah, I'm trying. <laughs> oh, I see vanilla Coke. Is that uh, vanilla Coke? Oh, uh, what a waste. <laughs> yeah, vanilla, vanilla Coke. Coke. And you guys, I do see a lip smacker, like lip gloss right there. They do have the lemon, you know, shaped lip balm and the apple and the strawberry. And then a lot of these foodie clips. <laughs> That's just kind of funny here. And, you know, stationary too. LA Colors Loose Face and Body Shimmer, you guys. Okay, this is new here. Um, they got Gold Dust, Fairy Dust, and Pixie Dust. Okay, for a dollar. Oh, that's funny. This one looks just like the one from Walgreens I just saw. Um, LA Colors Mascara. Not bad. I remember junior high, high school. I was not allowed to wear makeup in junior high, but I would wear mascara. I would buy Wet n Wild because it was only a dollar. Alright you guys, that is going to do it for my Dollar Tree walkthrough. We saw some Christmas items, some candy, and like a little bit of stocking stuffers. So I am going to go ahead and go. Well, they have that here, huh? And I will see all of you guys in the next video.